Welcome back to Mainframe. This is John. Tonight we're going to play the Alien Cube. It's the second in the series uh, from Guzo Production. I'll post a link down below in the description. It's available over at Steam. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. Chapter 1, The Event. The most merciful thing in the world, I think, is the inability of the human mind to correlate all its contents. We live on a placid island of ignorance in the midst of a black, of black seas of infinity and was not meant that we should voyage far. H.P. Lovecraft. Oh wow, right from the start. I really enjoyed the first for, uh, first game. I just recently played and posted that, so maybe you can catch that. Where am I? I'll post a link to that one down below in the description too. Oh gosh, look at this. Okay, we're doing the WASD. See, jump, crouch. All right, we got that. Do. We need a lantern. I can see the outside, but the crack's too small to get through. I must find another way out. Huh. Nope. Oh, we're back this way. It's over here. Okay. Machine from the first game. Uh, these big doors are finally firmly closed. This mechanism must be open. Oh, doesn't work. Even if the gear is missing. Yep. What the hell's that? I don't want to see that. I'll take the gear. I'm assuming I'm supposed to get it, but. want to avoid that creature, I want to see what it is. Alright, yeah, well, let's get out of here. Alright. Can I get it? Alright. Outside the green grass and beautiful flowers. And a, and a waterfall. Now, are we near the cabin? In the first game? You know, for, for an older engine, the cry engine of this era is still beautiful. So, it's been a while since I played this. I don't know which way I'm supposed to be going. What's going on? question is, is it alien or demonic? Either way, we gotta check it out. Just, just wrecked our serenity. Uh oh. 
Another nightmare. I'm looking forward to the next in the series of these of these games. Whoa. What time is it? I'll record and play those two here. Uh, let's see. I need to do anything? No. Let's get out of here. I found myself writing on the pages of my journal once more, hoping it helps me to fall asleep and to find peace again. Nights are troubled by sudden, unexplainable awakenings more and more often. I immediately afterwards bathed in sweat. I feel terrible, terribly tired and have an unpleasant feeling that I've experienced something upsetting that I don't remember. On second thoughts, Though all of this could be due to recent events, the breakup with Jenny, the move, and finally my Uncle Edgar's disappearance, the latter event in particular must have upset me more than I'd have expected, considering the unclear nature of the facts. What the newspaper reports is very strange indeed. Only God knows what happened to him. My new home hasn't helped to improve my situation. Perhaps it's just too early. I need more time. I guess his uncle's the guy at the cabin. Shouldn't assume, but I'll, we'll go with that for right now. Milk, eggs, juice, dish soap, rat poison. Nice. Call Pete back. Yeah, for the rat poison. Food. Uh -huh. We need food. Uh -huh. Any more food? What do you got there? All right, let's keep going. Let's move on. This door opened. What do we have here? Downing water in the bathtub. Hmm. Yes, yeah, so I was thinking about the dream. It was as if that strange object was calling me. I was feeling a deep primordial instinct that disturbed me. All right, well. Who's at the door? Oh. It's probably the postman. Postman drives a little station wagon. Author, my dear nephew, if you're reading this letter, it means that I'm gone. I gave instructions to a close friend to deliver this message to you in the event that something bad should happen to me. In the last few years, we lost contact with one another, I know, and I'm sorry for that. <clears throat> My life changed a lot, and I am only a shadow of the man you knew when you were a child. I know that is that it was hard for you not knowing who your mother was, especially after your father's death. I haven't always been there for you, but I was going through a rough patch. I hope you can forgive me for that. As you know, I have never been married or had children, so I decided to leave you all my possessions. Woo Even though I don't own a lot. Your inheritance consists of my apartment and the old cabin in the mountains, which used to belong to your grandparents. This is all I have left. The apartment is situated in the building at number 13 Oldwood Street in Winter Falls. It's quite old and in bad condition, but I could not afford anything better. Amongst my belongings, you will probably find some things you won't be able to make sense of. Okay, I ask you, dis ask you to discard everything without question. I'm referring in particular to my manuscripts. They are very personal and, as you will perhaps have been told, writing was, was my only solace in my darkest days. I ask you, therefore, not to read them and not to delve into my research. Get rid of everything so that nothing can be found. You will find the apartment key in this envelope. Do what you desire with it, but I beg you to respect my last wish. I have always loved you, your Uncle Edgar. Aww. <clears throat> okay, so we got the key. My letter from my Uncle Edgar. It seems that he left his old flat in town to me. I didn't expect that, but I better go there immediately. What do we got here? My cassette player, I'm going I'm not going anywhere without that. What year is this? Guy has a cassette player, huh? 
books. That was my collection of ancient books. I still need to arrange them on the bookshelf. Okay, he just moved in, I guess, huh? I'm going to start a fire. <laughs> We're getting ready to leave. I'm starting fires. Oh, so it's broken, but he keeps it as a, as a keepsake. All right. Feel sorry for Jenny. I got a car key. All right, do I need a change? Yeah, probably. Let's get this investigation going. Got to find out what happened to Uncle. Uncle Buck. The long trip Edgar's flat is many hours away. All right. Well, that's right. We got to go to his flat. Uncle Edgar disappeared more than a week ago, yet I've just received a letter from him only to find out that I am his sole heir. It's such a long time since I last saw him. I was only a child at the time, but he must have been fond enough of me to leave me his possessions as a legacy. I have never seen where he moved to in the last few years, but after having something or other, we're going to go check him out. Oh, but after having driven for many hours, I finally reached my destination. The address given in the letter led me here to this old building in the worst district in Winter Falls. The apartment should be up there on the top floor. Oh, well, this place looks... Actually, it looks pretty bad. There's stuff here. Oh, is that it? What this one? With the last one. Here it is. This is Edgar's flat. The lights were on all this time. Oh, shit. that? It's a gnome. Can I have the gnome? Oh, you found a secret. Oh. What made that noise? Oh, great. Strange mechanism fitted to the wood. Something has been removed, showing the gears. Huh. Oh. Okay, so I'm supposed to... Well, I found that in the hallway. It doesn't work now. We got pizza. Someone's been eating pizza. What's that? Oh. That's weird. There's no handles. for that. All right, let's check out the rest of the uh, the apartment. Trap door. There's a trap door, but it's stuck. All right, so we have here. Right, play a mean piano. Yeah, see, look, there's two horses, so I got to find another horse. Finally, after many years, I returned to the old family home. Unfortunately, when I arrived, I saw that nothing of the house was left. Everything had been reduced to a sad pile of rubble. However, it was there among all the debris that I found this strange chest. Although clearly very ancient, it was exquisitely crafted, made from fine wood and decorated with strange geometric symbols that I had never seen before. At first, I didn't notice this. As when I was a child, I was used to seeing all kinds of bizarre objects around the house. Found who knows where by my father during one of his countless journeys. The chest, however, had something sinister mysterious about it, so I decided to extract it from the debris and try to open it. I hope that writing this journal will help me overcome my 
shock at my discovery because I found inside the terrible chest is not something that could belong to the to this world. Huh. The drawer is locked. What happened to this mirror? We got a flask. Got hammered. So Right, there's something metal that's spark sparkling under this grate. Right tool, I should be able to open it. Okay, so I gotta find something with the gears and the grate. Mold and dirt everywhere. Over here looking at the toilets. Alright, so um, switch. I already did the switch. So how do I What the hell's going on? Go through? Alright. Oh, this place is a wreck. Look at this. Okay, so that's blocking the, the door. Okay, so at least we can get out in case we get chased. Let's start looking at the room. That doesn't work. Oh, well. It flashed. Painting, painting. Oh, there's a strange crack beneath the painting. Maybe I can move it. Lower the painting. I can't move. It's firmly attached, fixed to the wall. Oh! <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna die from botulism. Oh, that food was spoiled. I shouldn't have eaten it. Yeah, really. I thought I was gonna see what it was. Oh, there's a terrible smell here. Can my uncle live in these conditions? What's that? I'll examine. Oh, that's disgusting substance. It smells terrible. I don't like the idea at all. Can I try to get through that? There's a hole? Alright, let's do that. Yeah. Oh, great. I got botulism. I k get kicked in the face. <gasps> oh, wow. He won't bother us. He won't bother us anymore. There it is. It seems that the God's eye is hidden there. Yes, my lord, I will go there immediately. Oh, great. We got some kind of cult. Oh, God. My head. Where am I? Locked to have oh, to find a way out of here. Look at this needles and drugs. But move. Get through there. Examine. Here's the gate. A grate. It looks quite weak. Man, could try. Yeah, let's hit it. Let's get through there. Can I get through there? Go through. All right. Very narrow, but I have to try. Oh, great! We're right next to a toilet. This is pretty cool. I don't remember this part. Been quite some time. Locked. Locked. Now these people are. That's October 30th, the disappearance of old William's son, Edgar Mitchell, caused us quite a few problems. It has been hard to keep track of every officer. But fortunately, they didn't find out anything at the scene of the fire. The purpose of that building must remain secret at all costs. At the moment, the case is in the hands of our men in the police. That detective won't set foot in our territories anymore. However, we must find out what happened to Edgar 
and close the case before someone else snoops around. We'll start by checking his apartment, November 5th. We have proof of the existence of the God's Eye. The priestess was right. During the inspection of Edgar's apartment, we found some papers belonging to his father, Old William. Everything suggests that he was in possession of the sacred artifact without us knowing it. How is it possible that such a trusted member of the order betrayed us? We are trying to understand where his hiding place is. Also, all signs point to a location out of town where there used to be an ancient village inhabited by our ancestors. All right. Okay, yeah, we saw that. And we saw the picture, so I guess we saw... Okay, so these are locations of importance. All right, where were they spying around? Who are these people? What were they looking for? I don't know. Documents, already read that door, did that. That's going back. Let's, what's in this room? Okay, that's where I crawled through. Anything in here I can use? Like that. Like that. Screwdriver. I'll take it. Oh shit, let's get out of here. Can we get out of here? Ugh. Okay, I never have imagined I'd never have imagined my uncle could have lived in such squalor. The apartment is in very bad condition and there is dirt and mess everywhere. The weirdest thing was the presence of a hole in the kitchen and a stranger who attacked me and knocked and locked me in a room. Luckily I found a way out, but who was that psycho? He didn't look like a simple criminal. He behaved as if he was part of an organized, organized crime group. I found some upsetting research on Uncle Edgar in the apartment next door. It seems that they were looking for an ancient artifact that was owned by Grandfather William. What else is hiding in this apartment? There are still many things to discover here. Who knows what Edgar was investigating before his disappearance? Okay, so they're trying to drop me a clue that I should stay here and look around, but... Oh, wait a minute. The vent. Alright, got the screwdriver. Oh, there's a bug on the floor. Alright, what do we got? Small key. Okay, so what was locked? Oh, the drawer. Right? What do we have? Great, more reading. After the horrific discovery, finding the answers to my questions became a real obsession. So I started to study my father's old papers in depth. My research uncovered the existence of a mysterious order. Its origin w are extremely ancient. But apparently it still exists today. <coughs> Excuse me. Indeed, I found clearer reference to it in my father's notes, and it seems that he was even a member. I also found out that in addition to the old cabin in the mountain, my father owned many other properties scattered around the area. I didn't even know. Why didn't he tell me about them? There was one place in particular that was very important to him, and it seems that he did everything to keep it a secret. I made a map showing its location. I'm going to go there immediately. Okay, Northwood, Camping, Stonefield, Black Hill Forest, Black Hill Castle, Rock Valley. All right, we're going to go see a castle, man. Can I get up there? better go there now. I'll come back here later. All right. Close the door. Let's get out of here. We can leave the door open. We're out of here. We gotta go camping. Exit. All right. The road is getting arduous, but I shouldn't, I should be almost there. My grandfather's secret place should be in a valley near an ancient castle, not far from here. With a bit of luck, I should be able to arrive there before anyone else. Those who captured me are heading right there. Yeah. So we're in a big uh, race to get there, but they already got a head start. I had to crawl through a hole and dig up something from the bathroom and all kinds of crazy stuff. All right.
There we go. See the, I want to see the valley first. Oh, yeah. Is that where we're going? Alright, let's get going. Is this what they drove? Yeah, I'm just still warm. Someone got here before me. I mustn't get caught. Alright, let's go. Alright. Get the lantern? No. Wanting no trespassing. Well, this is my property. The grandfather's property should be should be behind the old building over there. Well, which one? There's one right here, and there's one farther away. Don't matter. I'm gonna fall. got all dark and sinister. I love it. Alright, let's check this place out. Oh, I can't jump that. Oh my head, what happened? Did I have a hallucination? Oh. oh can I skirt around? Supposed to, I'm not supposed to go down, am I? Now, see, I came this way, so. Oh, it's it's got to be down here. Oh, wait a minute. I think I remember. I'm supposed to do something with a log or something. getting late. We gotta find uh, what we need to find before it gets too dark. It's getting dark already. Oh, uh, there's a door. Can I go this way? Let's go. I knew sooner or later we're gonna have to go into a dark, creepy cave. Actually, this looks like a castle entrance. I gotta do a jump. Oh. Well, no way. This is a one way trip then. I can't. Do I get a flashlight or a lantern like last time? There's something down here with us. Do I want to see what that is?
up or down fork. This one's more lit. I think we chose wisely. There's the lake. need the fuel. We have found a wonderful place for camping. Apparently it's right here among these mountains. That those strange events occur. Last night we spotted strange lights in the woods. It seems the stories told about these forests are true. We immediately focused the telescope on the point where the light beams appeared and we looked through it. None of us could believe our eyes. We were all shocked. How come that planet was so close to the Earth, and how does one explain that it's not there anymore? What we've seen makes no sense. Something very strange is up here. Okay, let's get out of this. Alright, so can I kind of look? Yeah, it looks like the moon, right, Mouse? Yeah, it looks like the moon and some stars. So let's get out of there. Alright, well, I guess the planet left. So, um... <laughs> burned. Uh, I have to go back in the cave? Yeah. Alright. Right? This is all enclosed. Is there a way out of this? Oh, that's a pretty good fall. Nope, that's blocked off. Alright, so let's... Head back into the cave. Well, I picked up some gas for something. We're going to find out what that something is here in a minute. Alright, so now let's go this way. They sound like it's about ready to collapse. Got journal entry. I've never been. I never imagined that my uncle could have lived in such a crawl cave. Yeah, we already read that part. So. All right. So, what's over there? This. These places are full of secrets. We are all excited at night. We observe the sky and those mysterious lights. While during the day. We explore these magnificent tunnels. The whole area is full of these underground galleries. It will take days and days to explore them. They're of, int of instable value. Instable value. Who knows what kinds of ancient discoveries we might find deeper inside. It said that there was ancient underground cities here. Connected to each other by a network of tunnels that were populated by obscure cults. In recent history, however, no human being have, has gone into the depths to confirm this bizarre theory. These tunnels are very dangerous indeed, as they could collapse at any moment, not to mention the risk of falling into one of those ravines. Rosa scared me when she said that she'd heard a strange voice coming from the depths of the abyss. Who knows what she really heard, but it was probably just a poor animal that had fallen down there. Yeah, see, this is... Well, let's go. Alright. Alright, so... I go straight, because I took that... Took that turn. I went up, then down. Alright, so we go back. And let's try this way. We got light. Alright. Oh, generator. Alright, what do we have? Oh, it looks like dynamite. Looks like it's gonna fall apart. Gonna make it. 
it's gonna run for it once we get out. Right, let's go. What's going on here? What is that? The red eye of Sauron? There's some railroad tracks. Let's see if we can find it. Let's see if we can find a trail. We came down here. I saw somebody look like a Friday the 13th or Jason chasing some... I gotta make that jump? Really? Yeah, huh? Uh, Alright. Just about killed myself. Oh, there's... Come on, dude. Shake it off. Let's go. Oh, I just fucked myself up. Gunshot, somebody running this way. It's locked down. I can find a way to get past the fence. I hope that in the building there's something I can use to heal myself. It's gonna walk a little faster now. It looks like a dead end. Try the other way. Can I go under the fence? Yeah. Oh. What about, yeah, maybe up there. Yeah, I could probably get through right there. Guy's probably got compound fractures. Got a shin bone sticking out of his leg. Oh, I feel like I, this guy's drunk now. Medicine cabinet. First aid. All right. The first aid had everything I needed. My leg is better now. Yeah, all right. Look at all that weird stuff. Okay, there's a cube, and you got. People worshiping the cube. All right, it's pretty self-explanatory. Oh, we got a cassette. sound effects. Might have to listen to that a little more later on, but... What the hell's inside these containers? We have so little knowledge of the world around us. The vision of the sacred place have finally begun. The distorted reality they reveal is extremely fascinating. But what was I experienced? But was I, what I experienced? Or was it just in my head? I could feel clearly that my body was there. That is, was part of the place. Next time I record everything with my voice recorder, I want to be absolutely sure that what I experienced wasn't just a vision. The sacred artifact has um, unimaginable power. I was lucky to find it while I was alone. It would be insane to let the other members get hold of it. No one must know. <coughs> Yeah, see, there's a ladder I could have used back at the apartment. Well, let's let's get out of here. Follow this trail. I'll grade another door. It's locked, of course. I have to find a way inside the cave. Who knows what my grandfather hid in there? Yeah, it's always locked. Yep, it's 
this? Little wooden boards down there. I'll manage to break them. I may be able to open the passage to get through. Oh, well, I gotta find something to break that with. Great. Is there an axe? You got firewood? Yeah, he's got firewood. Is there an axe? Firewood in here? I don't see a fireplace. The axe, hatchet, hatchet, axe. Alright. What's up there? Another cabin. Alright, so maybe just chop the door down. Boards. Okay, so that was it. Making progress. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, can we open that door? No, I guess not. Can I take the lantern? <coughs> I need a torch. Here we go. It's all true, I managed to record everything. This is a confirmation I was looking for. I never imagined I would one day be walking right there in the outside. The place is beyond description. There's one thing I shouldn't under underestimate, though. If I can see, I can be seen, too. Next time I'll have to tread very carefully if I want to go deeper. Something must have noticed my presence. During the out exploration, I sense a dreadful, malign presence that I still can't explain. That gaze, I can still feel it upon me, even now while I'm writing this journal. So, that it, there's a cube object. I'm gonna subject my guy to every possible cruelty imaginable. Alright, let's go. Come on, shake it off. Walk it off. We gotta go back? Yeah, we gotta go back. In my head, what's happened to me? Did I faint? Oh, listen, wait. Alright, we got a lantern, or the cube. The glowing cube is showing us the way. Yeah, I don't want to know what that was. Let's keep moving. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's already night. It's already nighttime. How is that possible? I must have been out for many hours. I better go back to Uncle Edward's apartment. I'll be able to study the cube there. All right. I'm gonna head back to the apartment, huh? Do I know which way the apartment is? Or my car? This 
way. Oh, yeah, this one's locked. Uh, isn't my car like supposed to be right now? Maybe I didn't go back far enough. Oh, I had to hop the little chain. Where's my car? Tire tracks. Let's go back on foot. Let's go. What's that place? camping gear anyway. Back at Edgar's. The members of the order are everywhere and now they have now they know I'm in possession of the cube. I'm lucky to have found it before they did. From now on I must be careful. These people are fanatic and I mustn't allow them to catch me. I'm sure I'll find more information at Edgar's apartment. I hope it's a safe I hope it's safe there. Excuse me. Hmm. Well, if you got attacked, knocked out, locked up, I don't think it's, it's safer there than anywhere else. As a matter of fact, it's probably safer at the cabin. You can run around into the hills or mountains or something. All right, here we go. Oh, yeah, now they cleared this. Everything the same? Yeah. Before I start looking for clues in the apartment, I have to find a safe place to hide the cube. Let me guess, up there. Use virtual experiment, I'll find the answers I've been looking for there. All right. Oh, great, no power. You got a flashlight? No. Do this all in the dark. Gonna be for that mechanism. Wait a minute, these are the people. Should I go in there? Let's go here. Take a shortcut. Watch me get attacked again. Alright, let's see what this is all about. It was here, right? Right. Oh, I 
Can I get him a face the right way? Oh, the painting. I forgot the painting. We got more sound effects. It sounds like wind in the creature. Like a spooky Halloween tape. Alright, so lover. Disgusting stuff seems to be to have come from the mirror. Read that, read that. Alright, we got blood on the keyboard. Alright, let's keep going. No switch? No. Chest. Chest is secured with a strange mechanism. I need to force it with something. Oh, we gotta look for a crowbar. Got there. Photographs. Cave entrance. Ooh, look at these. Are kind of cool. Welcome back to Mainframe. Sorry about the disruption. We had a, a thunderstorm coming through the area. I thought it best to shut everything down. I was a little distracted, so let's continue on from where I left off. Okay. Okay. Was this place really my father's secret hideout? It's difficult to believe. But everything suggests it was. I tried to bring as many things as I could with me to examine them here in my study. Many of his notes are written in a language that I don't know. However, this is his handwriting, I'm sure. Those bizarre photos did nothing more than lead me to ask more questions that those landscapes are so unreal. And what the hell are those huge structures in the distance? It looks like my father was doing research into an ancient artifact and its connection to some mysterious place populated by some sort of horrible beings. Well, what does this all mean? What was he really working on? In the shed there were some strange statuettes and old cassettes too. I brought them here to study them. Now didn't I have a cassette player? Right, these are the photos. All right. These are cool looking. Put them next to my action figures. Okay, so the chest is secured with a strange mechanism. We need to force it with something. You know, maybe there's something in the attic I can use. Alright, so I did that, did that. Let's, let's see, did I go up here yet? Yeah. The strange contraption is the most mysterious object that I, that I took from my father's secret hideout. What it's, what's its function? It seems that it allows the creation of a small magnetic field, but something's missing for sure. There was an ancient metal door near the hideout, but I wasn't able to open it. It may lead deep into the mountain, and what I need is probably right there. The whole area is full of tunnels and old galleries. People say that in those mountains there's a huge web of underground passages that stretch for miles. But now I, th but now that I think of it, the family cabin is not far from that place. It's right on top of the mountain. What if somehow everything's connected by the tunnels? Are there more of them around there? First of all, I should go to the cabin and check it out. I'll leave early in the morning. All right, the old picture of my family's cabin. And that, I guess this is. Change machinery. Place the cube there. All right. Um, outdoors. Let's, anything else up here? No. All right. Yes. All right. No. No. I did the floor. No. Alright. 
because we're going to have to go through the other apartment. to me. Maybe we go back to the cabin when we're boarded up. What? what does this mean? Yeah, I don't like that sound either. Let's the other way. Yeah, let's avoid that one. Grab the lantern. What happened? What is this place? Yeah, really. Slice and dice. The fire doesn't emit any heat. Some kind of mechanism to open it. Okay, so we gotta find something that goes in that. Alright. I guess we're going down. Buckle up, here we go. Uh oh, they're saving, so apparently we got something ahead of us.
this again. Look around. Wandering in the dark. crazy in there. But I don't think, I think there's more to it. Maybe I missed it. Alright, right, we'll start again from the top to the bottom. find a mechanism that fits in there. Stop that spinny thing. So now that's it. Gonna go upstairs. That's the uh, mechanism we're missing. All right, so. All right. What's in here? All right. Well, where 
of this way. Now we're back where we were. Well, in a way. Went through the little tunnel. I knew it, just a telemarketer. Alright, so what do we got here? What the hell? What, did the creature capture me? Did I die? Am I dead? What am I supposed to do, run? Alright, let's do that. Let's check this out first. I'm supposed to run and hide. area now. Alright, so we survived the telephone. We survived the telemarketer. Alright, so now what? Alright, so let's... I don't see him. I'm afraid to run around if this thing's coming at me. Alright, let's see. Nothing. Can't get back there. Gotta be some kind of supplies. Alright. 
so we got our hammer, so let's get out of here. Hammer time. Killed once by that creature. I don't have to. I don't want to have to go through that again. I don't seem to be anything on the other side that I can use a hammer on, though. So, use hammer on this. Yeah, that's the lever I came in, so I'm supposed to go forward. journal in a minute. What do we get? What is it? I'm going to look at it before I take because it disappears. Uh, it looks like a skull with horns. All right. Found a secret. I don't have an inventory? No. All right. What was the crazy place? Did I have another vision? No. What I experienced can't simply be my imagination. That place was real and I was really there. I'm sure. It's like I was living in another reality, like I was trapped in an endless nightmare. The cube was... The cube must be the cause of all this. What's its real purpose? Who made it? Yeah, so where is the cube? I've lost the cube. I've got photos, journals. He said earlier he has to head back to the cabin, so let's see if we can go back. Checked out the other place. Oh, just can't leave. First, I have to take the cube. Was well, the cube back where it was? No. All right. So let's check out the other apartment. If I was a cube. An alien cube, where would I hide? I will go upstairs in a minute. Not here. I don't think it's in the bathroom. It's probably upstairs in his lab again, maybe. Trashed. We did the journal. Oh. Oh, the glowy light. Thing ups 
stairs. voices and we pulled the lever. Okay, we did the horsey thingy. We wrecked the music. Took all the pictures, did the box. Read the journal. Alright, so I'm missing something. I'm in the bathroom. to go back to the attic. Alright, let's go. I think that's everything in here, right? Right. Did the other room, did this room, that room. Uh, make sure the attic one more time. It's not hidden someplace. All these boxes. Yeah. Can I get over there? It's like a cassette. Well, I can jump over there. Alright, alright, we made it. scary Halloween Halloween sound effect tape that's it huh oh, there's no other section right, there's a green glowy thing in there I made this level really dark Get there though. All right, let's see if something's changed because we listened to the tape.
Mm. Can't get the place out of my head. What I saw has been in my head the whole way. Edgar's cabin must be somewhere among the mountains. I didn't imagine it was this high up. There's a lot of snow here and it's freaking freezing outside. There should be a gas station just ahead, but a fallen tree has blocked the road. Of course it did. I'll have to leave the car here and continue on foot. So now we're going to an abandoned mountain, mountainside gas station. All right, let's check it out. get chased or eaten by a wolf Let's check this place out before we do anything. What's, this, what's it say on the sign? No, oh, nothing. The fence, can we get in here? Trails, which leads to Edgar's cabin, but why is it closed off? Got Edgar's truck. Anything we can use? See the cube. I'm gonna look around first. Uh, that store is a bent. Oh, I'm gonna go that way. Oh, we can get through here, can we? All right, so let's grab the cube and go through the fence. We can go through here too. All right. way first. Yeah, there's a house. Go that way. Well, let's back up. There's a house up there, too. Let's check this one out first. So this one they're not going to give me a lantern we managed to successfully divert the attention of the press the Mitchell case risks becoming a big problem for all of us from now on we'll pay more attention we fenced the whole area so it will be easier to defend to defend it our men and the police will handle the problems and ensure that no one asks questions anymore the great priestess appreciated our engagement and once again her direction is essential. She is the mother of, of all of us, and her wisdom has guided us for generations. As a resort, I and a few others will be privileged to undergo the first transformation stage. In this way, we will become stronger, and our bodies will age much more slowly. However, we will have to isolate ourselves from society and spend the coming days in our shelters as we wait for the day of revelation. 
Uh, so these guys are all in, all into it. All right, can we go down here? Shears. I've been here since he was killed. The blood is still fresh. Something's else. Oh, am I supposed to get out of here? We go back the way. Let's go back to the gas station or see if we can get down to this house, go up to that house. This is like a, a cliff drop off, right? Yeah, I'm doing that. I think that gate's covering a, uh, a certain path we gotta go. Right through there. Yeah, see it's blocked off. Alright. Making progress, here we go. Alright. Oh, we gotta crouch. Is this the, no, this isn't the house we saw, but it's another one. Alright. It might not seem necessary in this one because it might be a little bit brighter and easier to see in the dark, but I missed the lantern. It gave a certain spookiness to it. Jews in this in this game. All right, what am I supposed to do? Go up this ladder? Nope. All right. Go this one. Examine yeah, snowdrift. Snowdrift is preventing me from passing. Oh, so. Uh, what am I looking for? A shovel? Anything in the igloo? 
check out the house again. Door. We got a hammer. Oh, shovel. Alright, we're good. Yep. Demonic kaijus. They're going to way. sighted the creature once again the same day Edgar disappeared we saw it for the first time it is a magnificent specimen that is evolving very fast its growth is outstanding and soon it will reveal its final shape the sacred tomes tell a tell of similar creatures sent by the ancient gods to punish people punish the people oh great we're we gonna see this guy again I mean he was pretty huge I'm all messed up. Look at that. Is that him? No, it's just trees. Alright, let's go. Oh, he already went this way. Look, he knocked all the trees down. We're on his trail. see him, but I don't want to get stomped on or something. I don't know if he's down here or up there. Is it ice, or can I, can I walk on it, or... I should swim for it, man. Hypothermia. Let's go back. Maybe I'm supposed to go another way. Try this way. Oh, okay, yeah, here we go. I think. Uh huh. Well, we got another journal entry. We went the right way. They came back. Juan and I have been taken and carried out into the heart of the forest. They tied us up and blindfolded us so we couldn't see what was happening. But we could hear everything. I could still hear those terrible chants. They had never spoken before that moment, but when I heard those cries, oh God. Then suddenly they went away and left us alone, but something huge approached and took Juan shortly after. I will never forget his agonizing scream. Luckily, I managed to free myself and run away. But what am I? But what I've seen, I don't even want to think about what would happen to me if I stayed there. This abandoned church is the only shelter I've found. There are skeletons everywhere, and everything is covered by a vicious substance, viscous substance. But it's better than staying out there. I'll spend the night here, and then I'll try to go back to the car. A terrifying creature, no, it can't be real, it's not possible, I, I can't tell visions and reality apart, my mind is falling apart and I feel I'm losing control, but I can't give up now, the call is getting stronger, the cube must be nearby, 
This whole area seems to be under the Order's control, and it looks like Edgar's cabin is the heart of their territory. It seems that he knew nothing of this, but how is it possible that he didn't know? The cabin belonged to Grandfather William. Was it another secret location where he used to meet the other members of the Order? I have to reach that place, but I have to be very careful. They know I'm here. All right, so we're on a stealth mission to uh, Grandpa William Cabin, huh? Reg you. What do we have here? Oh, great, more. Oh, that's what we saw walking through the forest. That's a kaiju. All right. trash. How far is that your cabin? Did I get lost? I hope this is the right way. Yeah, I think so. There's a light. Let's go check it out. This way we go around. Let's see. I hear breathing and I see scary chains. Let's get out of here. Let's go this way. I got my heart pumping again. Well. So much for that. Let's keep moving. What do we got here? Oh, great. We're going to be attacked by a pack of wolves. I'm going to calm down. Good, we're out of here. The cabin should be nearby, but I can't find it. I think I'm lost. The temperature is dropping quickly and the wind is getting stronger. I shouldn't have come here. I have to find a way to warm up or it will be the end of me. Oh, okay, so we're going to go. We're going to be doing um, a little survival mode here. Chapter 6, Edgar's Cabin. All right, good. A little bit different from the first game. The Land of Pain was good. I posted that earlier, so hopefully you've seen that one. This is part two, I guess, to it. Or it is part two, so... Alright, let's go. Yeah, okay, so I gotta find places to warm up. I'm gonna follow these lanterns then. I'm freezing. 
There's fire right there. We need to find shelter. Here we go. As soon as possible. <laughs> uh, fire. Now the fire went out. I'll have to stoke it with some wood if I want to get warm. Oh, great. We got a pile of wood. No. Okay, grab that. have to get. Another couple. Alright. There's one. I don't want to go too far. Any more? Alright, now. Let's head back. We're going the right way. Hopefully I didn't get too turned around. I see a light. Grab that. Yeah, I'll grab it all. Alright, there we are. here so let's go get warm real quick there's no notes or anything right all right so let's go check that tower out that can we get up there right. we should be able to get up there I keep hearing twigs and branches breaking in the distance, so... Okay, what do we have here? Try this one first. Ring the bell. Heading to the cabin again, we've warned everyone we're going to hide and watch him. We can't allow him to find out anything. Well, they're spying on him, huh? Keep going. Just it. Oh, there's a path. All right. I'm assuming we gotta go that way. I know you shouldn't assume, but it's a video game, so what are you gonna do? That open the door? Yeah, the lever opened the door. All right, let's go. Are we still freezing? Yeah, we're still freezing. Second. 
These are large maps. No, I'm off exploring. What's up here? I think. Ooh, what's that? Another creature. We'll take it. Let's go. Finding secret statues, we got them. How do I get back without breaking my neck? Bunny hop. Oh, don't tell me I'm stuck. Yeah, no. Let's get into the fire real quick. Right. Warm up a little bit, get rid of the uh, cold. you and wolves and freezing weather <laughs> guess we're going going down warm enough yet all right let's see if we survive this without breaking our ankles. Yeah, let's warm up. Let's take a look. I know this place. It's Esgard's cabin, but what's that thing? Oh yeah, that's from the land of the pain. Land of pain. That's it. All right, let's do the heat thing one more time. Anything else? All right. So, assuming we're supposed to go down. 
check this place out first. Oh dear. Shears. the slippery slope. see any fire. We gotta go across, go across an icy area. Oh, well, let's go. Yeah, if we fall in, we're done for. Let's go around this way. Cabin. Let's see if there's any kind of heat. We made it back. But did this place burn down, the first one? Now we're dead. Alright, let's try this again. I'm going to run all the way this time. Burned down though. Alright. What was that? That spherical thing. It seemed like something otherworldly, not man made. As soon as I touched it, I saw a bright light. The world around me began to warp and bend in on itself. And I felt fear, an in indescribable fear, unlike I've ever felt before, when, for a moment, it felt as though I were leaving my body. The terror, it was so strong, my sense abandoned my senses abandoned me. When I opened my eyes, I couldn't believe what I was seeing. I was in a place I've never been before, trapped in a cage. Fortunately, I managed to escape. But what happened? Where am I? I don't recognize this place. I need to find help. Yeah, that's from the land of pain. What is this? I think from down there, is there here? <laughs> Trap door. Damn, it's frozen. I can't open it with my bare hands. Oh, great. I gotta find something. I gotta find... Anything behind? Let's check the other room real quick. Back out in the cold, right? Right. Okay, read the page. Trap door. Gotta, gotta pry it. With what? Uh, let's see, anything behind?
check the door. Oh, that's an, it looks like an elevator. This way. Yeah, this floor is ready to fall apart. Do I chance it? Now, let's try this. I might have to jump across that. I don't know. We'll see. Discoveries from outside were lost. However, we must be eternally grateful to the Order and the Priestess for the secrets that they passed on to us and that we will, we all are keeping. Unfortunately, the God's Eye was lost by our ancestors. If we could get it back, all our questions would be answered. I don't know about that, buddy. I think you're headed for disaster. So let's make our exit. Messing with stuff you shouldn't be messing with, like Ouija boards and stuff. Alright, let's go. Can I make this or do I have to go that way? Oh, alright. Let's go. There was a little trap door thingy over here. I want to see. Yeah, I already saw the dead guy. This. Can we go down there? No. All right, let's go back to Edgar's cabin. Or what's left of it. Burned to the ground. Let's see. Trap door. All right. trip. These won't be freezing anymore. Nothing, nothing. Did Uncle Edgar know? Excuse me. It all began when the God's Eye fell to Earth. We remembered it was the uh, remembered as of that the great priestess was chosen by the gods to witness it firsthand. Since then, all her children re-experienced the moment in their dreams when they were ready to be called. On the day of the event, however, the God's Eye wasn't the only thing to, to arrive. Okay, this place looks so familiar. Where have I seen this lake before? Huh. We got weird Tesla coils. Of course, we got a Frankenstein body. A corpse here. What are these? What the hell are these things? You know, I wish I had my lantern in this one. Supplies. But that water's ice cold. It's locked. That one opens up with this one. Nope. No, it's still warm. I'm writing this report in case I won't survive. I don't survive. Mary, Brad, and I were going to Rock Valley when we stopped at the old gas station. Suddenly some hooded guys came out of the forest and caught us. Everything happened so fast. We couldn't even see their faces because they were wearing horrible reptilian masks. 
they have blindfolded and locked us in what seems to be big underground a big underground facility. I can't tell where we are, but there's definitely a lot of water and some big machines in operation. They kept us in here for days in separate cells, but today something happened to Brad. He must have seen something terrible. He was out of control and ranting about monstrous, th monstrous beings, unspeakable abominations and the end of the world then they must have taken him we have neither seen nor heard him any heard him anymore okay do i want to go out there power. Am I supposed to be running through here? Oh, these are those egg thingies. Yeah. Uh, stop here and read the journal. Before we go further. All right. What else is this? What else is this? place hiding. I had no idea there was such a huge facility under the cabin. Well, what is it for? I can't believe Grandfather William was involved in all this. And what happened to Edgar? What I saw in the photos was bizarre. There was a strange object in front of the cabin the day of his disappearance. I don't know where I'm finding the strength and the courage to proceed. This place is testing my sanity. I'm lucky I haven't been caught so far. I'm sure I'm not the only one here. Well, I, I haven't seen anybody alive yet, so chances are they're dead, so... Flooding the tunnel, do I need to run? Let's go. We're going this way. Yeah, let's go straight. I guess we open these things up, huh? These grates. archaeological dig. I have a couple of those. What's going on here? We got stuff. Yeah. This place used to be a temple belonging to our ancestors. Each temple stood at one of the entrances to the underground passages where the ruins of the ancient cities are still can still be found today. The statue represents the great ancient. 
who appeared in physical form on the earth on the day of the event. Together with God's eye, we, he united with the population, birthing a new line with divine blood. From that moment, our sacred order was born. The diagram in the dome shows the structure of our universe with the outside en en enveloping and containing it. Only the God's eye can show the outside, which is situated in a superior dimension where the great ancients reign. Okay, so... More puzzles, I guess, huh? I got that. Squiddy dude. Reptilian alien guy. Gray guy. Got a boar, a dragon, a squid, and a hydra, I guess. Pretty cool. Alright, so what do we... Go this way. Go that way. I don't know if we're trying to escape or if we're being fu funneled to an area. We're probably going to be sacrificed. led to the slaughter. What the hell hit me? Am I supposed to be running? Yeah, let's move it. Or did he have another mental break? made me jump. I couldn't get through the door. So we have to start over? Are we dead? Or Oh, no. It's chapter 7 of the temple. Where are they taking me? I don't remember anything. Oh, God. I'm losing a lot of blood. Oh, great. He's bleeding out. I can't hold on much longer. I feel my strength is giving out. Oh, great. So they've handicapped critically injured our uh, player. Now we got to do some running. So we'll see where we go from here. Having another mental break. A break from reality. Yeah, this isn't how your apartment is, buddy. You're not Corpses lying everywhere. Yeah, let me get out of here. Watch, where, are the, where are the keys? Oh, great, now I gotta look for keys in this place. Okay, yeah, can't go that way. On 
the key. All right, let's get out of here. Guy's losing it. His cheese has slid right off his cracker. All right, and where the hell are we? How is this possible? What's going on? Yeah, really. That voice. It's calling me. Can we go take a look. What have I seen? I can't believe it. What was that thing? No, no, we're, uh, we're gonna get moving. Uh, I'm badly hurt. It's a miracle I'm still alive. Are there some people over there? Over there. Yeah, there's like somebody standing there. Alright, so let's follow the, the lights. Yeah, my guy's pretty busted up. Hasn't eaten, hasn't slept. Hasn't gone to the bathroom yet. He's been stabbed, poked, burned, <laughs> frozen. <laughs> can't go along like this. I have to find something to stop the blood or it will be the end of me. Yeah. missing here. Huh. Another puzzle. Alright, well, first things first, let's stop the bleeding. trying to stop bleeding. It's shut. Seems to be locked. Alright, let's go all the way back the other way. Uh, past this little weird temple thing. Apparently I'm looking for a band-aid out in the middle of the forest. like a pyramid. Oh, it's a cabin. Got some rags or something. I saw it. Huh. Bandages. Stop the blood, but I can't go on this way. I have to find some help as soon as possible. On that door? Okay, so what do we have here? Now that we have found the God's Eye, we just have to take it to the, bi to the big final step. It will happen tonight. The stars are in a favorable position, and we are ready, all ready for the great revelation. The truth, is, the truth about the outside is waiting for us. And we'll finally unite with the great ancient to become one. I, you know, this guy, dude, you guys are like in some serious, mess with some serious stuff. Someone's in there, I must be caught. Right, let's get out of here. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, gotta be something here to do. Is there a lever or something? Thought so. 
Right open that up. Yeah. <sighs> Great. Yeah, I know, but am I... Oh, you know what? I Okay, yeah. If I go back to the temple, it says something's missing, so we'll put this thing in there, and it'll do its thing. Maybe we'll find Grandpa William, Edgar, and this guy, my character, can live happily ever after at the woods in the cabin that's burnt down. Oh, shit. Being chased? Yeah, I'm being chased. Yeah, let's get out of here. Alright, so. This thing, right? What am I supposed to do? Oh, wait a minute, there's two of them. That's right. One's behind the little cage deal. Alright, so I have to lower the bars. I really didn't pay much attention to it because I was bleeding out. Let's go. Where something else chases us. Can I keep the glowy thing? I can see in the dark better. Oh, maybe that door is opening. Okay, so we stopped the bleeding, we did the little glowy things, and then we opened the door. Let's check the journal. What have they done to me? It's a miracle I'm alive. My stomach is badly hurt. I can't believe I survive. I woke in a pit full of corpses. Those crazy cultists must have thought I was dead. But what is this place? I recognize the mountains on, in the distance, but this place is further downstream. The call is so strong here. Oh God, I mustn't. I write, writing this journal is getting impossible. The cube must be very close. I can't resist its call. I feel it. I can't ignore it. I must find it. Alright, so we're going to find the cube. Let's do this. Oh, how much you want to bet we're going to be going down? Yeah, so... O oh, great ancient, the most precious of your creations, the god's eye has been found. Thanks to its power, all of us will soon be able to be to come before you, to be judged by you. Take my belongings as a gift and make me one of your chosen ones, the only ones who shall become one with you. Yeah, these guys are... Uh, what's that money? Grab all that gold. Alright, let's... You guys are really in for it. More money. Well, at least we know where all the gold's at. What do we have here? No, okay, so we got a puzzle, I guess. Let's see. What is this? Eyeball. It is said that the great ancients rule the universe from the outside. They used to be a time when we could meet them, but that, but the means of doing so was lost in ancient times. Our ancestors told us of a place incomprehensible to our feeble minds, where all judge is held and the flow of time does not exist. Only a privileged few were able to understand the visions of the past and the future which appeared simultaneously in front of their eyes and to succeed in observing the great ancients and the magnificent creatures that serve them. All right, so what do we have here? Faces, razor. All right, some, some opened up on the other side. 
so. What is this? Anything? The old key. Alright, can I get through here? Fuck. Mechanism. Alright. We found an old key. I guess it's some kind of mausoleum. Can we get through here? Alright, we're out of here. Yeah. Anything? It matches. So we got those brazers. Are we supposed to do it in a sequence? We got the Jeeth looking thing. We got the reverse C, G, reverse C. Uh, the A thing. G, C, A, Z. Okay, so find the G. I'm gonna say this. The reverse C. A. And C, I think, right? Or Z, I think. Z. Alright, that did it. Let's go. I don't know if we have to do it in that sequence order, but it seemed logical. examining here. I missed it. Said something about examining. Alright, let's roll. Going through the door or the scary tunnel? Oh, we got the scary tunnel. Alright, it is said that in ancient times our ancestors succeeded in studying the secrets of the universe thanks to lost technologies. It was at the time that the first theories about the existence of the outside were born. This invaluable knowledge was lost in the mist of time over the millennia, depriving humanity of its most precious discover. Then the event occurred and the God's eye was consigned to us. It is said that the sacred object was sent by the ancients themselves to allow their disciples to reach their dwelling place. Well, right now I just want to reach the exit and get the hell out of here. This place, it really exists. Oh, this is where we, um, we first started, right? Let's go this way. We go up here. I'm going to explore this real quick. We got anything for us? What kind of creature is this in this place? I remember it clearly. It was in my dreams. Yeah, we started off here, didn't we? Damn it. Oh, look at this thing. Alright. What else is down here? Anything for us? Let's, uh, I don't know if it was a dream or a nightmare, but we're rolling. Anything in here? No. All right, let's get out of here before we get chased out. We'll keep it moving. So we came up that way. Now this is where we got the gear. And we had to do the thing with the door and the lever. It's still open. Yeah, we had to replace that, okay. Oh no. Oh, the slow heartbeat. Gonna speed up. Yep, they're saving. We're in for a run. Maybe. Looks like there's somebody standing there all creeped over in a hood. Well, there's 
somebody standing there. Oh, there is. Oh, there's a ritual going on. creepy guy right there. Chapter 8, The Truth. Well, not much information about this, so we're going to be sacrificed. Become fodder for the, the Ancients, or the Order, or the Cube, or the Sphere, or the uh, Kaiju, the Deer-Headed Kaiju. Saturn. Here, let's look. Let's take a look. Nope. Go that way. Look at this thing. I miss it when now seeing the. Uh, oh, it's what's his face. Yeah. Let's get out of here. Go that way now. Am I supposed to go this way? Let me double check. No, I think I'm... Yeah, this is all bricked off. Yeah, it's a fall. Alright, let's go back. I'm supposed to go this way. Can get down that way? Yeah, I think I'll die. Not. Yeah. Well, the ritual is accomplished, but the passage has been harder than we thought. Despite this, we are finally here, in the outside. Many of us didn't survive. Others are going and saying this place is incomprehensible to our poor minds. I can barely find the sanity to write these notes. We trained ourselves for this, but it wasn't enough. Damn, my head. I feel like I'm living in a distorted projection of both reality and of what puts in my mind at the same time. What am I really seeing? I can't distinguish between my thoughts and what my eyes are observing. All of this is indescribable. We must try to go on. The great ancients are waiting for us. Huh. And do I get a lantern for the great ancients? No. Dead end. I bet you we're going to have to go that way sooner or later. Yeah, see, this is all right. Let's keep going this way. We got a box. UPS delivers here. FedEx. This picture, I've seen it in my dreams. 
what's it doing here? What's all this? Northwood, Case Mitchell, the mystery on the vanishing deep end. Okay, so. Are we going down or up? That's pretty bizarre. Oh! oh. <laughs> Disorienting. Oh, that's cool. Little Alice in Wonderland type trip. Oh, we're going down. God, it's like my head is going to blow up. If we could only make out the way, we have a stick. To, we have to stick together and overcome this place, this phase. Or we'll risk being stuck here forever, imprisoned in our own minds. Okay, but I'm sure I'll make it. I had a clear vision of my future. I saw my union with the ancient, the transformation. <coughs> Excuse me. I can't wait. The ancients are close, and they're calling us. I feel it. bizarre than the first one, the land of pain. Which is good. Looking forward to a part three if there's gonna be one. Early visions, what do they mean? Can I get a coke? I'm kinda of thirsty. Can't do the addict. I don't think we should leave yet. Let's go back to the apartment. Okay, this was this is where they trapped me the first time. Yeah, whatever you do, don't touch the chair. Get out of here. Oh, great. in Wonderland shit. Let's see, examine. But that's my bedroom. What are they doing? Yeah. Going. Well, before we go that, let's take a look here. Oh, they got an elevator. Check out the apartment, the flat. Am 
This kind of looks like uh, doom when he went to hell. I don't know. Do I just... Oh, it's water. Now I can't see shit. Can I back out? Spin around? Great. I'm gonna get mugged in the dark by demons. now. Yeah, here we go. Going down. Women's lingerie. Spikes. All right. Left or right? Let's go left. Well, I can't see. Hopefully, there's no pits. You managed to go on despite some difficulties. It's not easy to rely on each other anymore because our minds are clouded by our previous and future experience, which somehow is materializing in front of our eyes. It's like we're watching the past and the future at the same time. It's incredible. We knew that time here behaves abnormally, but it seems that all time periods coexist in the same moment. Only a superior mind can deal with all this. The true form of the outside is around us, though we just need to know how to observe. How to observe. This is the only way to reach the place where the ancients dwell. We have all felt a strange presence around us. It doesn't seem to be one of the ancients, though. We have to tread carefully. We don't know what creatures populate this dimension besides our gods. Yeah, well. Your gods, not mine, and. We're here to get the hell out. We're gonna head for the sparklies. I see sparklies off in the distance. Yeah, you know, like I said earlier, I'm looking forward to uh, if there's gonna be a part three. After this, I'm gonna go ahead and record um, Soma. That's another old classic. Well, that's much longer. I might break that recording down into two or three videos. I don't know, we'll see. Stay tuned. If you're interested, check back or subscribe. We get notifications. Am I supposed to be running? Yeah, let's pick up the pace. And for the sparklies, I got two lights. these steel girders to go across.
It always has kind of like a Silent Hill feel. That's another game I'm looking forward to being released soon. Silent Hill, the remake. Let's see. This way. So far the trailers and the previews look pretty good. We'll see how the gameplay comes. But I like indie developers and so far, the past couple of years, double A games, not triple A games seem to be where it's at. Or even older titles, you know? They're just They're more about the game. Not so much politics, but whatever. Microtransactions. A jump. Oh, I have a feeling I'm gonna be running. Let's see. Aim for the center of the three. Maybe, maybe not. What's this? Oh, there's another one. Alright, let's... I got ruins. Okay, follow the lights. Oh, it is moving. Those tentacles way off in the distance. Alright, let's go. I keep hearing something in the shrubs, in the bushes. I have a feeling we're going to be chased. They say if you're going to hit a deer, speed up, so let's move. been here a couple of times. That was a stone bridge we crossed. Now it's wooden. This is a door that never opens up, but seems to be a <coughs> place of a lot of action. Alright, so let's go the other way. Uh, yeah, that doesn't burn. Yeah, this is the door we opened up with the thingamabob. Alright, so we have to go down. That way, or uh, try this way first. That was a spinny thing, yeah. Open this door, nothing here. I guess we're going down. Maybe. Let's check this out first. survival woke up in the pit full of corpses. Well, then we got all this weird stuff. Well, so. 
that looked like a person for a second. Should I go to left or? Well, we're gonna have to go left. Let's go this way. We are learning to handle the visions and to distinguish what our eyes really see. We arrived in a huge structure that seems to be overseen by the guardians. Under the order of the ancients, this must be the place where people abducted from our world are kept, waiting for the final judgment. Only those in whose veins flows the blood of the ancients will be chosen for the final transformation. Only in this way they will be able to become part of them. We've devoted our lives to achieving this goal. We'll be chosen, and our bodies and minds will unite with the ancients, becoming one with them. We just have to reach them and show ourselves. They will be able to recognize the blood that runs in our veins. I think this, these people are setting themselves up for a major disappointment in the least. Let's get out of here. Okay, we did that. Did that. Heard that. All right. I think we're supposed to go down now. Right, right. Into the abyss. Seems that passage seems to be closed off this time, unless I'm not able to, not doing it right. Yeah, all right. We go back. Let's try that one. This room had nothing, right? Right. We already did this one.
but this is me. No, it's not possible. No, no! Oh wow, I'm in a test tube. Well, that's what I've been saying. Well, I've been trapped in here the whole time. That's just my, all my imagination. Or is it just a distant memory? No, I'm trapped forever. That's it. Thanks for watching. This is John Mainframe. If you haven't seen it yet, go ahead and check out The Land of Pain. I posted that earlier uh, this week. Also, I'll be uh, recording and playing Soma. I don't know if I'll be able to do that all in one shot. I would like to, but most likely it'll be two or three parts. And with that, have a good evening, good morning, good night, and thank you for watching. If you haven't yet, please like and subscribe to the video. It does help. Bye-bye.